This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. That crust out your eyes. But I got to take you guys back. Maybe to the early, what, 2003? Four? 2004. Still working at MTV, by the way, but this was 10 years ago. And I had been there four years, and, and the company acquired a new television series that was executive produced by none other than Sean P. Diddy Puffy Combs. Take that, take that. And it was called Making the Band. And on this particular season, it introduced a variety of characters, of talented individual individuals that were trying to make their stride in the rap game. Out of all those people that was on that staff, there was none probably uh, more alluring, uh, uh, more polarizing, um, uh, more unpredictable than the man we have here with us today. The one, the only Chopper City. Appreciate that. Back then, he was young Chopper City. <laughs> young Chopper, yeah. right. And the crazy yeah. part is, that was 10 years ago. You were like, what, 16 years yeah. old? So you're still young Chopper City. Yes, I am. <laughs> but you dropped off the young. Yeah, and just Chopper City. Chopper City, man. Do you remember these days, man? I remember I was doing the uh, the, the making the band reunion shows with you guys. I remember, I'm, Sway. Yeah, and, and we go way back. We go way back, way man, back, way back, way back. And you're a legend. You're a legend now. I'm trying to be. You're trying to be a legend. <laughs> um, I uh, appreciate that. And yeah. you know, I, I remember that was such an experiment. You mm -hmm. know, for not only just for MTV, but for Diddy and, and just for the music business as a whole. Correct. That was when reality TV made the direct link to music and artists. And and, and, and actually, it kind of it kind of like started the reality TV yeah. of today now. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. That's crazy. If it wasn't for you guys, there would be no love none, in hip hop. None of that. None of that. Yeah. Thank you for that. Thank you, Diddy. <laughs> thank you, Diddy. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Right Chopper though. City. Right. Um, though. And, you know, and it was interesting because we, we watch you guys fight. We watch you guys record. We watch you guys perform. We watch you guys launch your careers. We watch some of the guys fall off. We don't know where they are today. Me either. Do you keep in touch with anybody from the your cast? I talk, uh, I flew Fred out. Um, mm -hmm. I flew Fred out to Vegas. I live in Vegas now. Yeah. I flew Fred to Vegas. You know, uh, he, was, he was, you know, he was, he was hanging in there. I gave him some gifts. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. Got him a Rolex. Got him a nice... You know, I look out for Fred. Uh, mm -hmm. I talked to Babs once in the blue. I talked to her this morning, actually. She must have heard I was going to be on the show. Yeah. So. yeah, yeah. Babs doing the Queen of the Ring thing. Yeah, yeah. I got nothing, yeah. but, but I got nothing but love for Babs. Babs, yeah. Babs remind me of a dude. Yeah. <laughs> she just gangster. She gangster, yeah. right? Uh, uh, I always love for Babs. Who else? It was, uh, um, Ness. Uh, me and Ness had our little differences, but now we cool now. Uh-huh. Um, Dylon. Dylon, 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 <laughs> Dylon, and Dylon. So who's Dylon? <laughs> I don't know, bro. I, you you, you got to understand this. I didn't know them. Yeah. You know, I, you know they, they just put us together for us to do what we had to do, you dig? So, you know, when it ended, I, I it's, it was like, okay, cool. Yeah, but it never ended for you because it didn't, not you, for me. You, the internet became Bless you. your best friend and your worst enemy in some it, cases. It, it sure did. So, so I wanted to catch people up on some of the things that happened um, since then, and then you could comment on it. Mm -hmm. uh, so I put together a little bullet point sheet right here, as you can see, Chopper City. It. By the way, he got new music coming out, a yes, new project called Woodstock. Yes, I do. That's coming out at the turn of the year. <laughs> yes, it is. And we got new songs. We're going to play one thing. And, oh, uh, yeah. and then what else we going to play? What else? <laughs> um, we probably going to play the Hey, Hey, Hey. Okay, the Hey, yeah. Hey, Hey. We yeah. got that? Do we got that? We'll get that Hey, 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 Hey. All right, All right so I'm going to take you back uh, to 2005, and this was after Hurricane Katrina. All right. And... Um, it was rumored that you wanted Puff to let you go off the label so you could tend to your family. Yeah. This is true? That is true. Okay. Uh, Bad Boy never dropped me. Okay. Uh, you know, Half PL, they called me back and forth, back and forth. Mm -hmm. But the Katrina thing kind of affected me to the point where music just wasn't that important to me. Even though, like, you know, the little Chris, this one, the little Chris Browns wasn't even the Chris Browns and yeah. the trade wasn't the trades. We was all, like, in the same, mm -hmm. like, on the same frequency on our way there. But when um, Hurricane Katrina hit, it just devastated me to the point where I just couldn't. I, like I was shell shocked. I couldn't. I just couldn't take it. You were shell shocked, and at yeah. that time, you were what about like 18, about 18. eighteen years old at that yeah, time. I was eighteen. Did you ask Puff for money? Uh, I already had money. Puff okay. made sure that we was already straight. Uh -huh. But I asked him for more money because you know, like my family was kind of like eating me alive. Mm 
Yeah. So I asked him for a little more money. He was like, Chop, you know, right now, you need to get back on the road, do your thing. And and, and remind you, I had people around me who was kind of like bad influences as well. Yeah. You know, from my homeboys, you know, to my, you know, manager. You know, they all like, oh, you should leave him, you should leave him. And I was like, you know what? It, it was just too much on me. I yeah, just too much on you, I just right. couldn't pick up the phone no more. For a young man. And I apologize to Harv and Puff to that, too. You, you, do y'all co- communicate at all now? Uh, I seen Puff once in the blue, though. I told him I apologize as a man. Yeah. And he was like, salute. And he proud to see me still doing my thing. Yeah. So that's all that mattered to me. As long as he was proud to see me still do my thing, I'm cool with that. Oh, seven, you was arrested from a warrant from a robbery charge. Yeah. That's true? Yep. That, mm-hmm. the, the robbery charge happened in 2001. Yeah. God damn, how old were and you, I ran, I, look, I, No, I was like 15, 16. Okay, okay, I, no, uh, I was like 15, 15. Okay, all right. Uh-huh. Um, uh, I ended up getting into some trouble in Baltimore because I was going back and forth from New Orleans to Baltimore a yeah. lot because my mama from Baltimore, my daddy from New Orleans. Yeah. So I was going back and forth, and I ain't had no money. And I was just acting a fool, and it happened. And when it happened, I, I, you know, I never went to court for it. I was on Making the Band with a warrant. That's why on Making the Band, I was riding the hill. Instead of Ke- uh, my real name is Kevin Barnes. Oh, so that's what that was, right? Oh, making a band. I was Rodney Hill. I thought you had a stage real name. Nah, nah, <laughs> <laughs> nah. I got a stage real name. <laughs> nah, nah I, I changed the name just uh-huh. so they wouldn't come get me. I know wow, it's crazy. He's going through all this. I okay. was. Okay, oh eight. You uh, you you caught another charge in Atlanta after you threatened to pull a gun out on another man from from after an altercation. That's true. Yes. Okay. Uh, in 2012, this is the one that had the internet like almost broke uh, uh-huh. when you got shot. Yeah. And they say you were in your Lamborghini. Yep. That you owned. Yeah. People didn't believe you owned the Lamborghini. I got a lot of cars. No, no, no. I'm blessed, man. Like, uh, you know, I was, I was, I was on my way to Chicago. Next thing you know, uh, I guess some dudes. Well, the real truth about it is. I, I was I was on my way to Chicago to holler at some dudes for a show. They gave me half of the money up front. As soon as I got to like like close 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 right there, I start seeing like a Buick. And when mm. I seen the Buick, I had a female with me, and you know I kind of seen it following me. Uh, my little bro, young boy, he was they was all the way behind. Mm-hmm. So I'm speeding, I'm enjoying myself. I got the female with me. I'm I'm having fun. I see the Buick. He, I'm, I'm like, where you at? He like, oh, I'm 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 right here. He's supposed to met up with me so we can follow him straight through to the little hotels and the hard rock. We supposed mm-hmm. to be going to the hard rock. But before we even got there, he kept trailing me, kept trailing me, kept trailing me. I looked at the little rest stop. I was like, you know what? All right, they following me. So I go to the rest stop. When I go to the rest stop, I end up telling the female because she ain't really ain't, she ain't really yeah, get it. Her, so yeah. I was like, look, Charlie, they some dudes following me. So she got all fr- she got all afraid and spooked out. So I pulled over to the rest stop. I told her to call the police. Mm-hmm. She went into the little thing. She ran up in there. So I, I guess when they seen her run, they already knew that. I already knew what was going on. As soon as they came up in there, Shaheen, we live on the air. Shaheen, thank you. Shout to Shaheen. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> Shaheen soon, Reed. But soon as they, soon, <laughs> soon, soon as that happened, they came out. They tapped on the door. They said, give it up. I had the Sosa chain at the time. Oh, yeah, I am the original Sosa. Yeah. I just want to okay. say that. Okay. Um, I had the Sosa chain on, and I didn't want to give it up. So I put my head down the ground, and I lift my paws, lift my butt in the air, and they just started shooting. And that's when you cho- you got caught, right? On yeah. the side, right here. Yeah. That's one. how many times you get caught? Like twice when it came in and not. Is that one right here? Yeah. Is it one right here? Yeah. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's <laughs> it. <laughs> not, not, not like not like that. Not in a bad way, but uh, okay. that changed my life, though, Sway. Yeah. When Talk that happened, that. my whole yeah. life. Um, basically, when I was up in the hospital, I was like, you know what? Chop, you wilding, you fooling out. You didn't have this little cat stacks incident. You just acting a fool. You just, mm-hmm. you going haywire. You like, it's like you don't even care about your career. I'm over here living different type of lives and you know, trying to get money in every way. And I was like, you know what? It's time for me to cut all my homeboys off. It's time for me to change my whole life. You know, because a lot of people, you know, they look at the making the band situation yeah. and they just think that I'm just old TV dude. But mm-hmm. they don't know I really lived a real life. Yeah. You know, I'm from mm-hmm. New Orleans for real. I'm from the real neighborhood of the Masterpiece, other babies. Mm-hmm. You know, I know all these people. We all from the hood. Yeah. You know, so I lived a different type of life and I just wanted to change my life. So I started opening up my third eye. Mm-hmm. And uh, like I said, it, I I I I just changed my whole life of perception. I I just I just went into a positive mode, and yeah. 
And so what, you, what did that bring you? Like a lot of folks, went, you know, did it they make was your struggle even harder, but better things came towards you or when you when you flipped your whole perspective? Um, I ended up getting in contact with a guy named Robert Freed in Los Angeles, California, and I broke down to him that I want to change my life and I want to take my career serious, and he kind of like gave me a little budget, and mm-hmm. that's kind of why I'm here right that's now. That's why you're here right now. Yeah. All right, man. Chocolate, <laughs> man. Chocolate wow. City. Shout out to wow. Robert Freed. Wow. Yeah. Um, changed my life. That's crazy. Give me well, a couple dollars. Okay, this extortion charge you caught in 2013. Sway know it out. <laughs> Lord have mercy. What, what, what was that? Was that, that, oh, was oh, that, that, nah. was that after the change? or? No, 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 no. That happened That happened in that same year of me getting shot. Okay. Um, what ended up happening was I was in New Orleans. What was that store called, La Daddy? Uh, La Daddy store that I shot that third eye open in. Antique store. I don't it was it, yeah. all right. So I, w- I went up in there. We chopped it up. I, we chopped it up before I shot a video up in there. Mm-hmm. Right. So uh, me and him, we went back and forth. I ended up buying this antique thing. He ended up giving me something. He seen the video. I shot the third eye video. He called me up like, yeah, I like the video. Uh, You owe me some money for this. I said, I'm not giving you no money for that. You gave it to me. Yeah. I'm not giving you no money. So he was like, if you don't give me no money, you know, I'm with the mafia, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And I was like, all right, well, I'm going to blow up your stove if you keep threatening me. Yeah. And he used that against me from a text. From a text a message. Text and Ooh. send it to the police. He threatened me first. first. Uh-huh, but he did it I, verbally. Correct. Yeah. I sent a text message. Yeah. He told the police. They locked me up in Las Vegas for it. And that was uh-huh. years later. That I didn't was... even know what I was getting locked up for in Vegas. So you have a And bit... I got sued. Yeah. He sued me for, uh, uh he smacked me for like $10,000. It uh-huh. cost him like... Two thousand dollars when I seen it. Yeah, he smacked me for ten thousand dollars. And you had to pay that. I had to pay it. Mm. And I'm on probation for how long? I got one more year. One more year. Unsupervised. Unsupervised probate. Man, like, damn. Like, like if something happens, sweet. Yeah. Like my life has always been when something happened, I made a mistake way back in the game. Years later, it'll catch up to me. It'll catch up. So right? now I try my best to stay out the way for everything I'm doing. So now with your new music, are you rapping about the consequences? I'm rapping about positive. I'm rapping about consequences. I'm rapping about you can be from this, you can come from this. Yeah. But you don't have that don't have to define you. Yeah. My my whole situation is it don't have to define you. I already did it all. I don't want to be a gangster. I don't want to be a D boy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I want to be the guy from the ghetto that can show everybody else that we can have fun with the white people and party at the at the functions mm-hmm. where where they don't even let us in for wearing what we wearing. Yeah. I want to I want to show everybody that you can be that cool towards you can go anywhere in the world and be accepted for being who you are damn. by just having good energy. And positive City, man, man. Yeah. God damn, man. <laughs> Words, man. Huh? Words. I remember how wild you was back in the day, man. I, I was I was there. <laughs> Can I jump in one quick second? Go ahead. Let me play the song. We're okay, going to come okay, back with it. All right. Okay. This is one thing right here. Chopper City is here. 888 742 3345. Chopper City, uh, swing in the morning. Uh, uh, sound like a drop should have been in there right there. That's the only thing. Just made the remix right Word. there, man. Respect. That sounds great, bro. Appreciate that, Sway. Yeah, that sounds that. great, man. I appreciate it. Chopper City hard. is here, man. And, yeah, um, yeah. Just watching you over the years, man, through the internet is how I would see you, man. It's good to see that you arrived at this place. Thank you. Hey, man, we up here, we care about people. I know you do. You know, other, you know, well, I can't speak on other folks, but we want to see you do well even when we exploit what you do bad. I know that. Yeah, we like to create a balance in it all. You but, know. but but life is all about balance. Yeah. The uni- but the universe tend to unravel the way it should. Absolutely, yeah. right? So I take the good with the bad. There it is. Yeah. Chopper City. We got Dario on the line with us from Michigan. Good morning. How you doing? <laughs> Hello? Yeah, what up, man? What you want to say? I want to say, job. I like it, man, but I, I don't really like that beat you just played, man. And uh, you can come a little harder next time. You know you know what? You know what I said about it, bro? I, I said to myself, I, I hear a lot of rappers making a lot of trap beats, and I hear a lot of music that sound the same to me. What I wanted to do, player, was do something different that, that distinguished me from other artists. So I appreciate your opinion, but I, I feel I feel like I just want to be different from other artists. I appreciate it, though. Thank you. D, thanks for your call, man. We got Jermaine on the line from Philly. Go ahead, Jermaine. What you want to say to Chopper? Hey, what's up, Chopper, man? Yo, what's up, bro, bro? Ain't nothing, man. The being too hot for TV, I remember it was the first Real album I ever bought. You know <laughs> what I'm saying? Thank you. Thank you. It wasn't no bootleg or nothing. And I used to perpetrate. I was in eighth grade and shit. And so I used to rap the lyrics to the ladies <laughs> and shit like that. I Thank used you. To be like, I used to be like, uh, 
You can catch me with hats and nigga. I catch balls in the motherfucking sack, nigga. I write back my job, my quick job, quicker than any bitch, nigga. That try to come and get this on my sister. I promise I make it part of my agenda to get this. I should used to be fired. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate he that. He spit the whole verse. He hey, did. Jermaine, man, look for that Woodstock, the album. When is the album going to come I'm out? I'm going to drop it on New Year's when the ball drop. Oh wow! I on am. New Year's. Yeah, I'm because because it's it's a different it's it's like a new world order to me. Yeah, I'm dropping Woodstock in, in, in memory of of who I used to be, criteria to who I am now. Yeah, mm. that's good. Yeah. Hey, we got Word. Kyle on the line. What you want to say to Chopper? He's in Pennsylvania. Go ahead, Kyle. What's up, Kyle? Yo, what's up, man? What's up, man? You keeping it real, man? It's some good shit you playing, yo. I appreciate that, bro. All I can do is be myself. That's all, Kyle, bro. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 If you're sucking now, hey, hey, that's what she hey, said. Hey. Man, <laughs> <laughs> hold up, man. Y'all stop singing, man. That's, that's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Chopper City's here, man. Yeah, bro. Damn, man. I appreciate being here, man. Y'all mm. don't even understand. I'm, I'm very honored. I'm around legends. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. like y'all, y'all, y'all out there ain't understanding how powerful this is right now. I'm very honored right now. Man, I'm nice. around straight legends. Well, you around friends too, yeah. though. Yeah, friends I, yeah, yeah. yeah. I appreciate that, that, that legend thing. You know, that's a beautiful thing. I love friends, but y'all yeah. are legends. Yeah, though. Rich Nice, he's a legend in his own skin. Look at him, man. <laughs> Shaheem, Reed, what, Shaheem in the come building, on, man. You still running around, big homie Shaheem. <laughs> oh man! What would you say his name? Watch this, yo, Chopper. Say his name, Shaheen Reed. Go ahead. Big Shaheen. <laughs> he walks around with a cheerleading squad, no matter where he at. When you say his name, he could be on the train. He could be at church, Shaheen Reed. Shaheen. <laughs> she just happens, man. Boy, it's legend. Now watch this. That's Reef crazy. the street. Thank you. Crickets. Respect. Straight <laughs> oh, crickets, that's man. That's what we do. Man, Respect. grasshoppers up in here. Respect. Uh, <laughs> Reef the Street is the program director here at Shade 4 5. Shout out to Reef. There it is. Reef, you like that last track we played? Sure enough. Yeah, how can he get his song in rotation here? You know, we'll talk offline. There I appreciate it. Is. Okay. See, that, see how that works? Thank you, right my there, brother. Man? Thank I you, I guess brother. we do got some pull up in here. Thank huh? you. Thank you. All right. All right. Hey, that's love. I appreciate it. Hey, bro. how can people reach you, man? If you tuned into this interview, it's one of the realest ones you're ever going to hear. Somebody Thank being you. totally open and honest as much as he can mm-hmm. about certain. A lot of stuff is legal matters, so you, it's, it's all, you can't yeah. really get too deep into some stuff. But, but you know what? Wait, I'm not even on that. I'm not even in that uh, that trouble world no more, man. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm focused. There it is. Straightforward. Mm-hmm. I'm focused, man. I ain't, I ain't in no more trouble I'm around good people I got a good 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 woman by me you know who That's believe and support me nice you say know? her name say her name oh Miss Donna Terrence you gotta say the Miss first Miss Donna Woo. yes okay yep. you gotta put a G behind that you yeah. gotta put a G behind that that's your yeah. real brother your blood brother's right here or? yeah that's that's my little brother young boy right okay. there that's Jay Lyric he from okay. the city he holds it down he okay. hot out there in New Orleans right okay. now that's Hollywood Leak right there you I see me? it I see him yeah. 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 yeah I know Hollywood yeah Hollywood Leak that's my body God slash role manager right there. Okay, we we, that, we call him Fat Boy. Yeah, Lil Rock. He must got a serious knuckle game. We look, we joke. Oh, oh yeah, he, he, yeah, he, he, yeah. We don't talk about that. Okay, <laughs> peace, <laughs> peace and love, peace and love. Yeah, we look, we, we we crack we crack fat jokes all day on him, but we love him to death. That's yeah, our that's our teddy bear. Okay, yo, Chopper City man, thanks for coming through. People Thank can reach y'all. you where? Man, hit them up right now. How can they reach you? Know you know what? Holler at me on Twitter, Shaheen. No, you should yeah, know. Yeah. I am Chopper. That's uh. That's I A M C H zero P P E R. Like I said, y'all, I really do appreciate being here. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just so, so blessed right now. Y'all just don't understand. A lot of people, you know, don't get chances like I get, yeah. and I'm just honored to get this chance and and be back in the game to where I need to be. And I'm gonna go straight forward, and I ain't gonna let nobody down no more. I know I've been, you know, in the past I was getting into a lot of stuff that I shouldn't have been doing. Yeah. But I, I promise y'all, I, I I won't mess up no more. Hey man, you still in your twenties, man. I that's really am, though. Man. But you got time, dog. I do. You but talk like, yeah. like you about to retire. So, oh, I'm nowhere. I'm nowhere near it. I'm nowhere near it. You ain't you ain't even live life yet, bro. I haven't. <laughs> you I know, haven't. You got time to listen. That's what you do when you're young. Can you believe yeah. I was 16? Uh, yeah, I do. That's y'all, crazy. y'all was doing some craziness on TV. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all yeah. was fighting. It really wasn't me that much. It, it was Fred. It was Fred and yeah, us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but uh, man, I'm glad you're here today, man. Chopper City, ladies Thank and you, gentlemen. Sway. It's Sway in the morning. Only on Shade 45.